YouTube, my name is Mesa Sean, and welcome back to another Destiny 2 video. Alright folks, it's Friday, which means it's Thursday. We're gonna go find him in a second. Real quick guys, I gotta ask you for a favor and to please subscribe to the channel. We are so close to 300,000 subscribers and when I was going through my analytics, the number one search term for Mesa Sean is, where is Zer? So if you watch my Zer videos, kindly hit that subscribe button. 61% or 60% of you guys who watch my videos are not subscribed. Subscribe. So what are you waiting for? Hit subscribe. All right, guys, let's go find Zer and see what he's got. Okay, Zer is located over on the treasure barge over on Nessus. You want to fly into Watcher's Grave and make your way over to here. So let's go see what he's got. Keep in mind, I did make a video on Wednesday that for armor coming up soon, I think in the next season, that Zer will sell random stats. These stats right now come from your collections. So he's got Hard Light, everyone's favorite exotic for PvP, even though they nerfed it, it's still pretty good in my humble opinion. We have the uh, Gwizen Vest, I butcher that every time, Hollow Fire Heart, and the Apotheosis Veil. Alright, Exotic Engram, buy this on a character that you need something on, because it is supposed to not give you duplicates outside of quest exotic. So if you need a piece of armor, let's say for your warlock and you're missing it, buy this uh, exotic engram on that character and hopefully you will get that piece of armor. All right, hard light. What's not to talk about this thing? When you uh, get the masterwork version of it, you get max stability on it. We have polygonal rifling. We have alloy magazine. The fundamentals. So when you hold down your square, uh, I'm on PC, but when I uh, use my Vantage 2, I can change the element. This comes in very handy in PVE. Composite stock. Now the main perk is Volatile Light. Rounds fired from this weapon have reduced damage fall off. It used to be in uh, infinite damage fall off until they nerfed it. Uh, but it's still the damage drop off. I did a review on it last week when they did the nerf and it's still, you could still like do crits pretty pretty far with this thing. Uh, over penetrate targets and ricochet off of hard surfaces. Projectile damage increases after they bounce. They nerfed it by about half in terms of that damage. All right, this thing for the uh, Night Stalker. This is for your Spectral Blades. So each Spectral Blade kill uh, you make before going into stealth will restore more of your super energy. So pretty good. I would grab that thing. Uh, this thing I do love for the Titan Sunbreaker. So we have Sunfire Furnace. Improves the recharge rate of your solar abilities. But you want to hold on to your super because greatly improves the recharge rate while your super is charged. So if you keep your super up and you don't need to use it, you will get a lot of grenades and if you're doing like let's say a nightfall no, not nightfall strike Vanguard strikes where you have grenadier on you're gonna be throwing grenades non-stop All right, this thing I have not used this in a very long time and I am a uh, warlock main Immediately regenerate your health melee grenade and rift energy upon activating your super Nearby allies recharge class abilities faster. So this could come in handy um, when your health is really low and uh, you're about to die, pop your super because you will get all of your health, melee, grenade, and your rift energy back. So, that's it for the exotics, guys. We have your usual Five of Swords card if you want to customize your old school Nightfall experience. And we have the Invitations of the Nine if you have not completed those. And I believe they give you a tier one powerful drop. So, that's it for the video, guys. And uh, that's it. Hope you guys subscribe. Leave me a good old hashtag, made it to the end, if you did make it to the end. And uh, that's it. Do me a favor, drop a like in this video only if you see fit. Follow me on the... Ooh, hold on. Follow me on Twitter, at MesaShawn. Check out my stream, usually and always on YouTube, and that's it. I am out of here like Vladimir. Sorry, guys, I paused there for a second because I thought my recording shut off, but it didn't. And, uh, I am unscripted, so I leave in mistakes like that. All right, guys, I love you guys. I'll see you later.